Splashed on the front pages of three Tamil dailies are reports on the ongoing MIC crisis. The first has reports on MIC President Dato Sri G. Palanivale, who has the support of members. Another speaks of how Palanivale is in conflict with his deputy, Dato Dr. S. Subramaniam. Yet another suggests for Prime Minister Najib Tun Raza to step in and solve the crisis. On Saturday, the spotlight was on Palani Vale and his team, who addressed a crowd of more than 3,000 people at the Putra World Trade Centre. The event started with speeches from eight division chairmen, who not only expressed their support for Palani Vale, but also to convince the people that he was the right person to helm the party and take back what belongs to it. The speakers were also determined to boot out the hooligans and do away with gutter politics which has taken over the party in recent times. In an attempt to pacify the situation, former Kada chairman Dato Dr S Subrabaniam suggested for negotiations between the two rivals, but he was booed off by the crowd. Later, Palani Vale assured that he was the rightful party president and said that he even had the backing of the Prime Minister. We don't want to go to 2009 CWC all because the Prime Minister told me, don't worry about all that, you just start your election from August. I discussed with him, so he didn't want to talk about new election, fresh election and all that. He said, you just start your elections from August and then we are just going to name the audit committee and the legal committee. Okay. So we will start the branch elections sometime in August maybe. The details of it we will give uh, it to you. After that, they will vote for me as president, all branches. And after that, we go for division elections. Then we will begin the AGM. <coughs> so the delegates from the division elections, they will vote for the uh, deputy, what, uh, and, uh, uh, deputy vice, vice presidents, working committee and all that. On whether the rival camps were agreeable to the August elections, Palani Vale stressed that he was president and he would decide. No, no, no. Don't worry about him. No, 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 don't worry about him. He has no authority. He has no authority. 2,764 branch chairman attended our meeting. Pledge support. And pledge full support for us. Full support for us, for my leadership and for the leadership of everybody else. You know, so that we can... Uh, we can push our mandate very far. Eh? The MIC drama, however, continues on Sunday when another assembly will take place at PWTC as well. This is where the rival team, headed by Subramaniam, will present their side of the story. The relationship between both camps was strained when the Registrar of Societies confirmed irregularities in the 2013 party elections. They then directed for re-elections of the Central Working Committee as well as the Vice President posts. Subramaniam declared himself as acting president and said that Palani Vale was no longer a member for challenging the ROS's directive in court without consulting the CWC first.